Hello Cold Family, this is Brian Melbourne with the Cold Bear Craft Company in London, Kentucky, www.coldbearcraft.com. What we're going to do today is we're going to show you how to take a plane from the folded position and make it a flying airplane. This is a newly finished airplane for a customer out in Southern California and we're going to fold this into an airplane for you right quick. Just a quick walk around. This plane's all set up for trailering. So it has the forward brackets tied in. It has the wing support tube installed. And the fold bracket on the tail feathers right here. So I've got Dennis and Dwayne here at the Cold Aircraft Factory. They're going to start putting this together. The first thing Dwayne's going to do is he's going to take this lift strut and set it into place and pin it. Then Dwayne's going to go from that position right there and he's going to pull this one pin out of the fold brackets that hold this in place and that pin actually goes into the lift strut. That's the outside lift strut pin that holds that in place for trailering. Just so he doesn't take a chance on losing that, he's going to take that pin and he's going to place it right in the lift strut right there. Then he knows where it's at when he needs it. Alright, Dennis is going to unclip and pull the rear bracket. He's going to take his bungee cord in that bracket and just set it right in the cockpit of the airplane so he doesn't lose track of it while he's working here. And then Dennis is going to come back and grab the tip of the wing with two hands. He's going to pull it off of the slide bracket. And he's going to carefully rotate this wing around, being careful of the exhaust system and the fuel pumps, fuel lines, and other stuff that's in place here. As soon as he brings this wing around, Dwayne is going to drop a pin right in that leading edge point right there. Sounds just like that. And then he's going to pick his lift strut up. And he's going to have Dennis put it in the right position to where he can hook that into place right there. And we broke the line's thumb earlier this week, so that's what that tape's all about. <laughs> so it proves you can even do it with a broken thumb. Right? Yes, you can. So this is the forward pin right there, and he's putting his clip in the back of it right now, the hairpin. And he's already put his hairpin into position here. So as he's going, He's completing this folding system. So we're just going to walk around the other side of the airplane here and they're going to repeat on the other side. Just exactly the way we did it over here. So Dwayne's going to unpin the forward attach point after he attaches his lift strut into position. And you notice he's setting his lift strut on a uh, on a cloth of some sort just to keep from just banging stuff up. We like everything to look brand new when it's done. So he's going to unhook the forward attach point. Just like that. And again, that pin belongs right in the outside of this lift strut. So he's going to stick it right into place there. And then Dennis is going to bring you a wing. Here it comes. And Dwayne's going to watch what's going on up top to make sure that we don't get into our exhaust system. Just like that. And rotate right up. And then he's looking for that position there. And he's going to pin and clip it. And it's best to put these hairpins in as you go. Just to make sure everything gets completed if you're going from trailer to flight. So then he's going to put this in here. Just like so. Alright. So he's got that pinned and clipped. And then Dennis is coming right over here and he's going to take the brackets out and get rid of those. 
gonna set them up in the cockpit. Probably just hand them to Dwayne right quick. And then right in here we have some Velcro that holds the aileron control rods in place. He's gonna pull those out. And he's gonna unpin and unclip because everything is in position for the next run. And he's gonna hook up his aileron. Dwayne's gonna do the other side while he's doing that. Okay, then the next thing we're gonna do is Dennis is gonna unclip and pull his bracket out. We have this clipped under the bottom so that when you pick up on the wings, it picks the whole boom up and doesn't slide out of there. So he's gonna pull that right out of there, get that out of the way, set it off to the side. He's gonna put his clip back in it so he doesn't lose anything. Very cool. And then he's gonna come right up here and he's gonna pull this bracket off of the tail feathers here and he's going to hang on to the other side so nothing goes flopping down we just want to take our time and make sure we get everything done right and you're just going to hang on to that with one hand and start setting his elevators down just like so and that top cable will hold them into place then you just want to check one thing just make sure that your cables are in position and nothing's doubled over and looks good and then Dwayne's going under right now and he's going to hook this cable up into that hole right under there and the two cables are hooked together with one bolt at this point there's a velcro center section and the cloth center section goes into the Velcro right here. So that will just slide up underneath. Just like that. And you're just gonna pull it tight on each side. And it just goes right up and over the top. That's a mess, Dennis. That shows them what we're doing. So we're gonna fold this one right back up. So that cloth center section just goes right in the middle. So they've already pulled their brackets from down there. Dwayne's hooking the cable into the back right now. And as soon as that is done, this plane is ready to remove that little piece of foam rubber off the prop. And if you notice, we put a little piece of tape right on the back of the prop. And that helps us remember there's one more thing we need to do. And that's remove that off the bottom and there you go one cold ready to go flying thank you very much if you need, need an airplane don't forget to call us 606-862-9692 website www.kolbaircraft.com k-o-l-b aircraft.com thank you guys have fun